Hi guys! So I have been doing some Etsy shopping and I'm so excited to show you guys what I got. So let's just jump into this haul. So the first place I got stickers from was Darth Taylor Designs and she had two different Etsy shops. She had Darth Taylor and she had Taylor Made, and I think she combined them both to make one now. So I think they're just Taylor Made, but there will be a link in the description below if you guys want to check her out. And then we have my stickers. It has this really cute little thank you sticker on it that has some little candy corns. So the first stickers you see here are absolutely adorable. They are the Disney Princess stickers, and there are eight different princesses on here. So there's Ariel, Aurora, Belle, Cinderella, Snow White, Rapunzel, Mulan, and Jasmine. And then they're just repeated over again throughout the sheet. I love this because I think I want to do my birthday week, which isn't until December, but I want to do my birthday week with Disney princesses and I think this is going to be perfect and I love it. And Taylor also had not only this Disney princess sheet, but she also had this Disney princess sheet. So there are all of the princesses on here. So there's eight plus eight more. So there is Alice from Alice in Wonderland, Anna from Frozen, Elsa from Frozen. Um, I can't think of what her name is. She's from Hercules. It starts with an M, I think. Leave a comment down below and let me know what her name is because I can't remember. <laughs> Tinkerbell, Tiana, Pocahontas, and Merida. And I just think that all of these combined are going to be super cute. And these will be nice for sticking into racks and stuff like that because there's no reason that I need all of these same stickers repeatedly. So that'll be nice. Then I got this sheet of kites because I'm thinking in the spring I want to do a come fly with me type theme. So I want to do kites and I want to do hot air balloons and paper planes and stuff like that and I thought that this would be really cute for it. I got this sheet of Essie nail polish bottles which Essie is one of my absolute favorite brands and I just think that these were super cute and another way to denote when I paint my nails. And there's like some classic colors in here that I definitely have. This one looks like cute as a button. I have one that looks like that that's called Fiji. Um, there's one that's a minty color that I know I have. So I'm just excited to use this. And lastly, I got this sheet, which I thought was super duper cute because it is cat in the hat themed or Dr. Seuss themed. So there's the goldfish, the cat in the hat, and one of the things... Is that thing one? I think that's thing one and a few other ones. So there's thing one and thing two. There's thing one and thing two. There's the cat in the hat. There's the fish from one fish, two fish, red fish, blue fish, I think is the book. There is um, the guy from I do not like green eggs and ham. There's, oh, the girl and the boy from cat in the hat. There's this guy that I can't remember what his name is that maybe it's from Horton Here's a Who. Um, there's the Grinch. I just think that this is going to be really good for March because March is reading month and it's reading month because it's Dr. Seuss's birthday and I have a nail art that's based on that and I'm excited to do a spread that's based on that too. Next, I have an order from J.A. Love Designs, or Ja Love, or I don't know how to pronounce that, but I have an order from her. So first we have a little freebie, and there's quite a few cute stickers on here. I love these little donuts. I love this camera, the stack of books, the laundry basket. I think it's all super cute and very usable. Then for the stickers that I ordered, I ordered all my stickers in matte because I just think I like that better than glossy. They're easier to write on, I feel like. So I picked up this sheet of credit cards because I'm trying to pay off my credit cards, so I think that this will be a good way to denote that. I got this large sheet of cleaning items, and this will just be a fun way to denote cleaning days. I got this really cute 
sheet of vehicles. They're all cars. I drive a black Saturn Ion and this car looks so much like it that I just had to get it because it looks like my car. So I thought that was perfect. And lastly, I have this sheet of donuts. I really want to do a coffee and donuts theme sometime. And I saw these and I thought that they were adorable. So I had to get them. Next, I picked up a few things from Delightful Lemon. And I thought that this was really cool. She sends her pictures out in a like page protector. So if you keep your stickers in a binder, I thought that, that would be really helpful. Like just to stick this in there with all of your Delightful Lemon stickers in it, or you can use it in any other way. I thought that was really cool. So with the Delightful Lemon order, I got this little sample. It is basically just a sample of the tree right here, which is kind of cute. Then we have my stickers that I ordered. So like I said, I want to do a coffee and donut theme sometime. And she had this really cute coffee theme sheets that she sells and I thought that they were adorable. I love them. They're so cute and I'm excited to use these. I love the weekend banners. They're just so cute. Then I got this sheet. I think this one, yeah, I think this one was her pumpkin spice theme that I just loved it. I love the colors in it. I love how bright it is and it's just really, really pretty and fun and I'm Thinking that this is already up, I'm going to use this in my plan with me that I'm going to be doing tomorrow for next week's spread and I just love it. I think it's so pretty. Next I picked up this Harry Potter theme because it is amazing. I love these boxes. I think that these are amazing and I don't even know if you can see it all the way. There we go. Look at these. These are so cool. I think these are so cool. I love them. I love that you get all the characters and the brooms and the castle and you get some books and you get a snitch and I just think that this will be really fun to do a spread with. Um, I'm not sure what I'm going to do a Harry Potter spread but I had to get it when I was ordering from, from Delightful Lemon. And finally, I just got this big sheet of Bill's Due. I think I ordered from Delightful Lemon during their Labor Day sale. And so there was a pretty good deal. I want to say maybe 30% off or something like that. Maybe even more. I'm not sure. But I thought that it was a really good deal. So I made sure to throw these in my basket because you can always use Bill Due stickers. Next, I got my order from Libby & Co., which... I felt like the, the state of South Carolina was holding it captive for two weeks because it was ridiculous how long it took to get to me. And I know she mailed them out two weeks ago, but the post office was holding on to them for some reason. But I finally got them, so I'm super excited to use these. So let's see what's all in here. So first of all, I have this little woodland creatures freebie that she had in her package and I think that these are adorable like this raccoon is so stinking cute like I can't get over how cute he is <laughs> I love that and then we have my stickers and next week is going to be a breast cancer awareness theme for me a little hint for next week for you guys and so I'm planning on using these stickers so I have, I think these are called the bubble gum set or something. So there's this sheet that has the weekend banner, a few like party, not party banners, what? Um, full boxes, some half boxes, some checklist banners, um, little icons, dots. There's canceled and rescheduled over here. Then I have this sheet also that goes along with it. It's the same color it's the same color scheme and there's full boxes and different appointment boxes and half boxes and half checklists and different banners and different icons and these are all little dots and I just think that this will go really well and make my life super easy without having to design a ton of stickers for my theme. Then I also picked up this full sheet of lunch boxes and or brown paper bags for lunch. They say lunch on them. I wanted these because I've been going and getting food a lot lately on my lunch at work and I want to try and pack a lunch for work instead. So that's why I got these so I know what days I need to take a lunch with me. 
Then I got this sheet that is completely books, and I love this. I love places that have books. Like, I would get every single book sticker on Etsy that I could find because I am an avid reader, and I like to mark my books down. So I like these because it's a nice variety of colors, and I think that'll just go good with a lot of different spreads. And finally, from Livia & Co., I bought this sheet of mustaches. I want to do a mustache November, a Movember, if you will, theme for the first week in November, and I thought that these were adorable, and I can't wait to use them. And lastly, I have my order from ohelloco.com. This was ohellostationery.ohellostationeryco oh on Etsy. Got a website, and I was able to order before the site went live. She had like 15 people had a password to go and shop online just so we could let her know of any mishaps or kinks that they needed to work out before the site went live. So I placed my order and this is what I got. So first things first, I have a, some stickers that I ordered and I'm not going to go over this again. You know that I love their packaging. It is the most unique packaging that I've had from any other Etsy shop and I love it. So inside of here we have the stickers that I ordered and it was really only this sheet that I ordered and I already used one of them. These are just their small packages. And then what she sent out as her freebie was the Oh Hello Stationery Co. birthday set because they have had their one year birthday and so there's a bunch of cute stickers on here. So then also from the site I picked up this set of masking stickers and these are really cool. They're just a bunch of sheets of different designs on it that have stickers cut out into them. So there's like a this there's this size that's about the, sh the width of a normal piece of washi tape. There's this size that's about the width of a thin piece of washi tape. And then down here you have several circles. So I thought that those would be really useful for different themes and just for decorating different things. And I like that there is a very wide variety of them and it's something different. And finally, I picked up three washi tapes. So the first one, looks like this and it is just some trees which actually they might be trees they might be feathers I'm not sure but they look almost like autumn colored trees and I thought that they were really cute and they could be used for so many different things and there's a nice variety of colors in them and I love them Another fall themed washi is this one that has a bunch of leaves on it. I thought that this was super cute and since I can't find the washi tape at Target, I thought this would be perfect for my fall themes because they're so cute. And lastly, I picked up this washi tape that is labeled as poppies, but it looks more like carnations to me, but they're still really cute and I really want to do a Wizard of Oz theme soon. I'm not sure when it's going to happen because of all the holidays coming up and stuff that I want to decorate for, but I really want to do one soon, so I picked this one up and I think that that will be perfect for a Wizard of Oz theme. So that was everything that I picked up from Etsy and I'm super happy with all of my purchases. Let me know in a comment down below what you guys have been loving and who you guys like to buy from. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you real soon. Bye!